with a brand new Caspa mainnet launch and loads of KRC20 tokens. It's really important to learn how to use this chain and of course how to buy and sell these tokens. That's why today we will have a full tutorial how to start using Caspium wallet. I think we're super early for the KRC20 and the Caspium mainnet. That's why it's really important to be the first and also be really well educated to make the maximum profits. So without wasting anybody's time, let's jump in straight to the tutorial. So first of all, Caspium Wallet is the ultimate self-custodial wallet for the Caspa network and it's available on the App Store, on the Google Play and also on the Android using APKs. So for this example, I will use an iPhone and download it from the App Store. So let's jump into the phone screen. By the way, you can find all the links in the description. Also, you can join our free Telegram group where we talk about different Caspa projects and different crypto altcoins. So once we open the App Store, you have to download their app. It's like any other app. So before the video, of course, I did it. So now let's open it. Once you open it, we have two options. So the first option is to create a new wallet and the second is to import the wallet. So for example, if you want to import the wallet, just click import. And again, we have three different options. The first one is import standard wallet. Next up, you can import legacy wallets or import watch only wallets. So I think for most new users and people watching this channel, this video, probably we're gonna choose the new wallet option. So let's click new wallet and we can name our wallet. So this is gonna be a test wallet for the YouTube, so I will call it test, done. Next, the actual app really recommends you to do it, but for this example, I will skip it, so no. Next step is extremely important. It's gonna be your seed phrase. If you've been in crypto, you know how important are your keys. So let's click got it. And you have to write down these words on some paper or somewhere really safe because if you lose your password, you can actually lose all your funds on this wallet. And you can click this number to select 12 or 24 words. So for this example, let's do 12 words. Again, save these words. I will screenshot it for this video. Also, of course, don't show your code on screen. I'm just showing it because it is a tutorial video. It's a test wallet. There is no money inside. So I backed it up. You know it's important when they ask you two times. Yes, I did back it up. Now we have to create a six digit pin code. Again, for this example, I will use six zeros. By the way, guys, you can crack my wallet. <laughs> it's gonna be, of course, zeros. And finally, we have set up our wallet. And the first tab is transactions. Second tab is UTXOs. By the way, for people who don't know what UTXOs are, I have this amazing link in the description explaining you how Casper works and what is UTXOs. Again, it's a really simple, short article explaining you what it is with really great examples. Next up, if you used any other wallet before, like Trust Wallet or MetaMask, it's really similar. Again, you can receive money, so click receive, and on top is gonna be your wallet. So if you want to receive, you can share the address or share QR code and people can can send you money or you can use centralized exchanges for example for this video you can go to CoinW, you can select caspa select caspa network copy your wallet from the app and you can receive caspa straight from the centralized exchanges like coin w again really easy to use and really similar to metamask or any other wallets next up if you want to send the money just click send it's the same thing just enter how much Next up, enter the wallet. Where do you want to send the money? And you can also add a memo. And if we click on the settings, again, nothing really crazy. You can select the currencies. You can select the language. We can select dark or light theme. Next up, we have security options. Right here, you can add biometrics and security passwords. You have the network and you have all the other settings. Again, it's really easy to use, really easy to set up. And I think if you plan to dive deeper into the Caspa, KRC20, Caspa mainnet, all the different updates, I think it's really Really important to be in the ecosystem, have the wallets ready, have the tokens ready, and also be subscribed to this channel because we talk a lot about Caspa, different updates, and we're also starting to look for the next KRC20 altcoins to actually add to our portfolio and of course make some money. Also reminder, we have a free Telegram group in the description, so join it and let's chat there. Thanks for watching, see you next time.